Anywho, um, remember the last um, Western Ultraman series we saw? Nope. I try not to. Um, well, this is um, a series. David it's Australia. Australia. great. Yeah. So that must mean it's great, right? Yeah, it actually is. I think it's a good series. Oh, that's nice then. It actually came out before Power Rangers. Oh. Huh. This is actually one of my favorite episodes. Oh, thanks, South Australia. Who, who is... Who is this man? Hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Ultraman Head. No comment on that man? No, no comment. I can't see any of them. It's just film negatives. I know like Ultraman's more human face. He has ears. Yeah, I mean... He should probably have ears. I mean, Ultras are just big balls of light, so probably not, honestly. Okay. They can't stop us all. <laughs> this is the one guy who got broke. <laughs> oh no, they can stop us all! He accidentally went to Area 52. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's where they actually keep all the alien stuff. So, so that guy just, like, walk in, like, they just, like, have this UFO with, like, some, like, hangar unlocked out in the open. Not the PNG! Well, here's another one. <laughs> I, I guess that's why they keep it unlocked. This this set looks like it'd be off of Red Dwarf. His brain is strangely multicolored. This guy could, yeah. this guy's be Eda if he was an asshole. So he's Sanders. No. It's just a peer and G. This, this is pretty overwhelmingly British. I'm not. I don't know how I feel about it. It's Australian, mate. Close enough. Right, did they just like bring his corpse over here? He's not dead. He's just brain dead. I I think that means you're dead. No, it's a fate worse than death. <laughs> No, you see, there's a big difference between really dead and brain dead. With with just brain dead, the the organs are perfectly good for harvesting. <laughs> yeah, like I don't I don't really think that's how death works, but whatever. I guess he's in a coma. That is some Australian ass backdrops. No, not the Australian biker games. You saw. Okay, anyway, who the fuck is this guy? <laughs> Anything you have to I don't know. I kind of lost the plot. I was just enjoying the uh, the is, melodrama. Is that, is that Andy Warhol? <laughs> I love that this guy. This guy is just straight up from a like very bad like 1950s movie. Yeah, I love uh, it's kind of got a. Uh, I can't remember who it is, but there's that one guy who just like makes books about killer crabs. It's got the same vibe as that. I'm still not sure who Ultraman is. It could be any one of these characters for all I know. Probably that guy. Yeah. Probably. Who's this man? Why does this guy sound like he's trying out for Willy Wonka? Maybe he's an alien. He sounds like he would be. He sounds like he would be like on that old Hulk Hogan show from the villain. Yeah, he sounds like he's like. No, no, Hulk show. I mean. He sounds like he's like you know the. He's like if Mr. McSplitwick was a serial killer. Is is that Doctor Strangelove? Doctor Insano. I do like the how straight to playing this. 
Yeah. Um, this is his ultimate power, but it's just being goofy shit. Just hope he comes out alive. Yeah. Oh, he's just going to the deprivation tank. Or Eel's gonna be in there. Uh, bees. <laughs> I believe you know one of our new recruits, Miss Echo. I, I don't know about the editing in this show, but I'm kind of here for it. Uh-uh. Yeah, that's what Ultraman sounds like. Well, I better get out of here. I think this is the what first. Is this is actually I think the first time um, in the series where you know the Ultra and the host talk to each other this much. Why does uh, Ultraman sound like he's like Mufasa in a sound booth? No way. Shindo's our only chance. Oh, fun fact: this guy was in the Howling Three. Uh, of course he was. He's actually also the best actor in this. He's actually really good in this. Yeah. I mean, I never watched The Howling, but I mean, who doesn't like The Howling? He was in The Howling 3. Who doesn't like the entire Howling series? It's a, it's a classic of horror cinema, I assume. Did one of the actors apologize to the original director for being in that? Being sequel. <laughs> oh, you know, that's just every horror sequel, though. They're all bad. He's, uh... Just brainwashing people or something? Is this just a militia group? Did we just start a cult? Are you telling me that a bunch of blue-collar white workers are being recruited to join a militia group? Yeah, why exactly is everyone here white? <laughs> Only the warriors will survive. <laughs> so, just a bunch of cats? Yeah. <laughs> well, Australia is the first place. Uh, yeah, but these are working class white people. What are they saying? We are white? No, no, <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> they just... You know, I think this happens in, uh, in the Purge movie, the, the Purge Forever. Look at some of these mustaches, though. It's like some Tom Selleck shit. This actor is having so much fucking fun. Yeah. I, like I said, I kinda dig it. <coughs> so, I, don't know, I think we're just, uh. I think our motivation is just survival of the fittest. Fucking kill everyone, I guess. Like. I like how menacing he just goes everywhere. Kid show. Why why are the guns making laser sounds? Because it's a kid show. Oh, okay. They're actually using actual bullets though. Kim, what's happening? Is this like in how in the X-Men cartoon? Wait, does she work for Davion? <laughs> you saw that mark on her shirt? Yeah. Look how in the X-Men cartoon, they, uh, all the, for some reason, everyone just has laser guns instead of normal guns, even the civilians. Yeah, because when you get shot by a laser, you're less dead than when you get shot by a bullet. Oh, oh god, they really do have laser guns. You <laughs> not the PNG! You could shoot him. You could shoot him. PNG is so beautiful! You could shoot well, him. yeah, they should. They could shoot him, but this'll be more funny. Yeah. And I think he just got 2001 right there. I guess he's just going now. He's, uh. He's reached the higher limits of, uh. of evolution, I guess. I think that's what the plot of 2001 was. Oh, yeah. There he goes. I guess he's just fucking off now. I was right, he was an alien. 
Ultraman. Don't ask me. I'm the one who got you out of there. We've got to stop Norbert. Norbert. <laughs> What's this? Oh wow! We, I, He's gonna attack the base. I couldn't tell if that was an actual jet. Probably not. I think it was an F-18, so no great loss. <laughs> okay. Just oh, are why are we here. playing ping pong? Very important business. Arthur? I don't care. Oh okay. <laughs> yeah, I like the green screen effect on the oh. screen in the series. Oh, that's... Right on us. Is, is, is this guy just like flying around blowing up shit for no reason now? Like oh, he wants to blow He's just like, yeah! Let's go! <laughs> Fuck him! <laughs> He's just having the time of his life. I think his plan has just completely fallen apart now, to be honest. Yeah, I'm thinking he was an alien and that whole story was bullshit to begin with. He just wanted his ship back. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know. This has gone on long enough. They hit levels one and three. Seal all oh. chambers. How many we lost? I think most got out. All right, Norberg. So some did die though. Grant! Grant. Yeah, they were all interns. Okay. So, uh, we don't need the auto defense systems. Your name's not Auto. Your surrender will prove beyond any Did this guy just forget about Ultraman or something? I think maybe the show forgot about Ultraman. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Uh, is this where we finally get Ultraman? He's going out in the middle of nowhere to transform. You like had to. He had to drive for like 50 minutes to get out here. Dozens are dead. I'm gonna see what I can do. It's oh my god! You're simply a casualty of evolution. You've got it wrong, Norberg. Evolution isn't just about strength, it's about harmony. Something completely foreign um. to your nature. Oh, oh god! You got to talk about soon, Grunt. No man is an island. You won't survive the death of your species. You're a desperate man, Grunt. So I guess he was an alien. Oh no, he's becoming a kaiju, I guess. U F slash O. All will become crab. <laughs> yeah, he ditched crab. Why did that ship let him go around for so long? Probably was it also up. just having fun? Um, it was probably just waking up a bit. I guess that kind of makes sense. Well, might as well blow up shit. Is that me? Uh, UFO, I guess, was also evil for no apparent reason. Hey, if you have lasers, you gotta use them. <laughs> guess so. Hey, is Ultraman gonna transform at any point? <laughs> to be fair, there's like, a lot of people dying. To, to be fair, there's like a bunch of guns pointed at it at the moment. <laughs> um. Yeah, that Everyone fucking bites dead. the dust. Oh, again, he finally remembered. <laughs> We can only have the Ultraman suit on screen for five minutes. Oh, wait, this, oh this, music, this music is actually surprisingly good. Yeah, it's got a good orchestral score. Yo! Yo! Oh! Banana! Spacecraft has a life force of its own, but it's out of control. It's being made that way. Oh, okay. So basically, um, Norberg is um, guiding his actions, even if he's dead. Okay. 
think he's not dead. I assume he like melded, or maybe he's uh, I don't know, he's a catatonic. <laughs> I don't know if he's dead, but I don't think he's fully in the cold, I think, anymore. This is a very uh, laser intensive Ultraman. Yeah, this, this series uses lasers a lot. To be fair, it's better than what Power did. <laughs> eh. Yeah. shove. Yeah. I guess they can't really have Ultraman and the Kaiju in the same shot. Yeah. Yeah, no. I don't... Don't, don't worry, most fights are not like this. I assume they aren't like, uh... They aren't like the same size, like their scale doesn't match or something? Yeah, it's more of a miniature. So they have the guy who's keeping... Are these helicopters? Are you... Are they jets? I, what the fuck are these things? I feel like this guy's design, by the way. UFO? Yeah. I, I like him. He looks like a crab. He's got a tail. He's like a scorpion crab thing. Da, 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 da. He's got a... A very 80s orchestral street is, uh, sound, to be honest. Also, yeah, this is one of those series that tell you that every episode. Oh, thank god. I would have never have known. Also, due to our polluted atmosphere, Ultraman can't live here because of the pollution. Yeah, that's actually kind of clever, I was. Damn. This, uh, these are the species we're losing due to global warming. I... I guess Crab's just fucking off now. I guess Norberg's fucking dead. Whoa! A man who destroyed so many minds himself was just mentally destroyed. Oh well. Uh, do the, does that shirt say "Oh whoa"? I was. It's like a bolt. Is this like that scene, like, what, 19... I can 19... play video games without even looking at the screen. Yeah. So, how no, did you feel you about me. power? I mean, um, great. Great. Uh, I actually liked it. It was pretty good. It's like... It feels like power done right, to be honest. Yeah, this... Where it's got that same kind of, like, B-movie feel, but, like, not bad.